Hello, YouTube. This is Bowtide Media and my Brady. best friend, my best man, Brady. Brady. Nice to meet you guys. Uh, we're going to do another episode of the Monster Cat Guessing Game, where you're going to have to guess the best and worst songs, or the most loved and hated songs. Uh, but this one's a little interesting because uh, you and I, obviously, yep. Uh, yep. we used to listen to a ton of Monster Cat together. A lot of Monster Cat, actually. So uh, tell me your Monster Cat experience. Well, uh, as Dakota, he we kind of came to knowing them about the same time through our Minecraft videos. Lovely. <laughs> um, and after that, fell in love with EDM music in general. So Monster Cat was obviously... Maddie on shirt. Yeah, Maddie on... We <laughs> went to the Maddie on concert together. That was awesome. First one ever. It was sick. Um, but yeah, we literally just started getting into so deep into Monster Cat, so deep into EDM. We started doing some DJ stuff, wanted to make music, got crazy. Um, but yeah. Just yeah, and then I think ever, ever when we went off to, or did university after high school, yep. we, we branched off a little bit more. We didn't listen to a yeah. ton of Monster Cat since then. Yeah, after kind of, yeah, I would say 2016, 2017 era, I stopped listening to Monster Cat every day or every week, per se. <laughs> yeah. Um, and more so kind of just let, picked a few artists that I kind of would check in. and. So who are some of your favorite artists that you still listen to today? Uh, from today? Pro a lot. Well, Maddie on pretty obviously. Maddie on Porter Robinson are probably two big ones. Um, Party Pupils. We love. Uh, what's another one? I love Smile a lot. Mm -hmm. Haywire. Yep. Uh, classic. Classic. Uh, what would be some? Hmm. I'm trying to think of ones that are EDM focused or not. Okay, so in terms of Monster Cat heydays, what would you Monster what would you Cat, consider like the best hmm. in like when we were listening to the peak days of Monster Cat? Who were your like, favorite artists back then? Oh, like I think the big ones would be World. If World song came out, that was like instant hit. Yeah. The next one would be uh, Rogue. Rogue for sure. Mm -hmm. Pegmore Nerds, bef like in their more electronic phase, like, um, like the uh, like, was it like, the Pink like, Cloudy, yeah, P? the electro house kind of feel that they had. A little less, not so dubstepy. Was huge. Pegmore Nerds was awesome. Uh, Fiji Ouija was great. Yeah, it's not um, Nitro too. Nitro fun. Hyper Potions came into it later, but they were a newer one of the newer artists that I really liked. Yep. Um, kind of took in like a future base as that's kind of where I derived. Um, and then um, hmm, I'm trying to think of another one that would have been uh, pretty fire. Hmm. I think that's probably good. I think that's they, probably encapsulates the most of the artists I appreciate. So with with this, because you listen to a lot of Monster Cat, we are going to play, or I'm going to play you songs that are uh, newer. So from I think from 2018, I don't think there's any songs later than 2018. Okay, wow. like 2017. All right. Um, so fairly newish songs, uh, and just a little bit of a caveat, uh, because, uh, the b boat rating system, if you like, want to come join the best of all time at Monster Cat rating, there'll be a link in the description below. Uh, but, uh, we're kind of running out of bad songs or hated songs because the Monster Cat doesn't put out a ton of bad stuff. Um, and so, uh, these songs aren't necessarily like super hated, but they're more or less like disliked. Like they have a general disdain to them rather than love. And so... Makes sense. Yeah. The longer we do this, the more I run out of bad songs because <laughs> bad we've, only done, we've done half the years of music, only half their catalog. Yeah. So uh, we're going to hop into it. First song, you know how this works, is 12 songs. Yeah, 12 uh, songs. I believe in you, though. I think okay. you can probably do like 11 or 12. I think I can do pretty good. I mean, I have a pretty good understanding of what they like. Obviously, I have a super, my own strong personal taste, but... Yeah. Uh, and if you have heard the song before, tell I'll us. I'll let tell, you guys tell us if you've heard the song before. But uh, here we go. All right. We'll put the headphones on. Here is the first song. It's kind of groovy, honestly. Wow. All right. Honestly, I am actually, that's a very unique song. I actually do yeah. like it. Yeah. I, I, I like, I'm very unique. I like, like unique stuff, not to anything that's mainstream, not a big fan. I personally really liked it. I think, who? I think the Monster community loves it, hates it. It reminds me, like, it's one of those ones that's super polar. Like, you either people either loved it or they really hated it. I have to go with my own taste, and I'd say people liked it. I think it was pretty good. You are correct. Because the production people, value sounded People do high. love it. Um, uh, do you know the name Bad Computer? 
Yeah. Oh, that was back computer. That's back computer. Okay. okay. I know back computer. So yeah. he he sort of came in right as you were kind of leaving, I think. And yes. He's, now he's like, is, a, it, is chasing clouds one of his songs? Yes. Okay. Yeah. I like that song. I like yep. chasing clouds. That was his most computer. one of his most recent, other than an EP. Yeah. So, um, but that was twenty twenty. Uh, this one was. This was recent. This was 2021, I believe. Oh, okay, okay. So yeah. yeah, I haven't heard any of his newer stuff. So yeah, that's sick. Yeah, good. I really like him. He's good artist. Here we go. Song, right. number, Song two. number two. One for one. Let me give. That one's tough because, ooh, man, yeah, you that was a good that was a good song choice. <laughs> hmm, this is a newer twenty twenty one song, I believe. Okay, okay, yeah, because oh, man, see, if that was like came out a bit older past, I would have said people would have liked it, but I don't think the styles people's styles been moving in that direction. So I, because uh, I like it. If that's not evident, um, uh, I'm gonna. I just have to say that they, people don't like that one. You are incorrect. Oh, they do. do like it's it. a okay. love song. Okay. Uh, have you heard the name Ellis? Oh, it's an Ellis track. Remember the Haywire remix? I feel the, like I've the, heard the, the Ellis. Ellis. Is, I think you've played me an Ellis song yeah. before. Okay, that's it's Ellis. Um, yeah. So that was Ellis. You're you're one for two though. So you missed that one yeah, sadly. See, I I it, it it was on the it was on the fence for sure. That was a really close one. That wasn't didn't didn't lean too heavy. I kind of took a gamble. Okay, here we go. All right, Song number, number three. three. One for two. Okay. So okay. it is future base. Yeah, and it's like, oh man, I I I I am just going to go with my gut because and say no one likes that song. Okay? Why though? What about what it's about your gut just, tells you? It's just for me, I'm a huge production and music music I leaned more to the music production side of things, so to me it's just it sounds a bit cheap, like it's not like a super basic song, nothing yep. really like unique necessarily, kind of like a trend false follower song, not a trendsetter song. So that's what makes me think it's okay. Not you are song. correct. Okay, it is a hated song. Uh, that was slander. If you remember that name, at slander all. did that. I they, thought he did hard. Like, they, they did a bit like of variety. Okay. They do like they do a whole bunch of stuff. Like I don't know. Okay, I don't know if you remember Holy, but that song like went hard. But then other songs, they go back and forth a lot. Okay, yeah, because so, that that did not. I had no idea that that. <laughs> yeah, it just sounded like yeah. No, they're yeah. just not. That's not. It didn't, didn't fit. <laughs> Okay, you can all right, on. You're all two, right. two for three. Here we go, song number four. Reminds me of Skrillex. Just gonna punch something. <laughs> Okay. Okay. <laughs> wow. Oh, man. I don't understand dubstep. And so part of the reason why I don't really like it is because I don't understand the genre. So, oh, man, that is tough. It is like, to yeah, spoke like scream Skrillex. But I think, oh, man. That one's tough, too. <laughs> that, that like, could go either way, and I would believe it both ways. All right. I'm just going to guess that people like that song. You are incorrect. That is uh, a hated song. Wow. Of course. You're only two for four. That was uh, Bear Grylls and Sullivan King. If you know any of those names. Yeah, I know the Sullivan King name. That one, Bear Grylls. Yeah, he does. He does stuff here and there. Is, He's done more remixes. That's the guy that d does outside and like on the. You know, oh yeah, no, yeah. Same, I know it's not same name. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, um, but wow. wow. Okay, I'm okay. actually impressed. You've got two rounds so far. Uh, yeah. I picked good, good tough songs, and I guess those are tough because. 
you know, I would believe if people hated that song because I didn't like it, but you know. yeah. Okay, here we go. Uh, song number five. All right. Oh, I like this kind of music. It's a quick answer. Yeah, I'd be confident. Yeah, I don't like that that is like pinnacle. That's a super sick track. I don't know what uh the genre would be, but I've listened to tracks like it and I really enjoy them, so I'd say that's people like that one. Okay, you are correct. That okay. is a love song. Uh can you guess who that's by? It's by two people that are just solo acts. Okay. Uh, so it's a collaboration between two solo acts. The bass, like, I would have... Nothing's coming to mind, but... Would they be artists that I'm familiar with? Like uh, One they're... of them, definitely, for sure. The other okay. one is a little more okay. newer. Okay. Uh, I'll tell you, they're both chill artists, for the most part. Hmm. Man, I'm so bad with artists. I just like... Oh, yeah. I, I know. Like that it's like a... I, I, I'm, I'm going to be a two artist. I'm going to be... Oh... Yeah, I have no clue. That's okay. <laughs> uh, it is Cloud Nun. Okay. And Direct. Oh. Uh, it's oh isn't little... that the one you want a Fiji to collab with? Uh, yeah, I do want Direct, <laughs> Fiji, and Cloud Nun. Okay, I, I know that me. much. I know that much. Okay. okay. Yeah, that's a good song. I Three for five, it. though. Uh, so that was actually one of, like, I think it's, like, number four or five on the boat right now. Like, that's, like, high, high on the yeah, list. Yeah, because I think that genre is, like, I don't know. It's think... house, technically. Yeah. Um, But... Because Throttle did a remix of one of his songs that has the same vibe and same with Zed. It was like a year ago or whatever, two years ago maybe. Hmm. It was pretty good. When did okay. that song come out? Uh, that would have been 2018, I believe. Oh, that's a... Yeah, similar time zone. To, same to that okay. genre too. So. Uh, three for five. Here you go. Song number six. tell you're finding it hard to enjoy that song <laughs> Nate, yeah i just don't i'm not a i'm sure i was trying to find something i liked about it but nothing really stuck <laughs> um uh i'm just gonna go with people don't like that song you are correct okay that is uh okay, that okay. is a hated song yeah um that was by gent and jaws Jaws. yeah i know gent and jaw or jaws not gent and, no it's a one person named gent and johns uh, oh okay. like j-a-w-n-s so they did a few stuff um, I think it's just one guy did a few stuff like 2016, 17, I think, and then sort of hasn't done a ton of okay, sense, okay, but, okay. uh, that was a not like song. Yeah. Sure. That makes sense. I, I could see that. Uh, four for six. So here we go. Halfway points. We're speeding up. Uh, yeah. If you get them all right, you'll be only be 10 for Which 12. Bad. It's not bad. Uh, but here we go. Uh, here's Jack number seven. I'm looking for the original song. Is this a remix? This is not a remix. Oh, really? That was very good. Yeah. So ironically, that song has been remixed. It got its own remix package. Okay. But I don't think you've actually heard any of those before. So I think you just thought of it as like another yeah, song. It, it, the, the, the barricade sound, like, bite sounded for, for mm. I don't know if that was unique to that song. But, um, yeah, I think my initial thoughts are that, like, I was just thinking of, like, playing Doom to this music. Because that is, like, a classic, like, <laughs> yep, yep. beat pop. See that. So people like that kind of vibe. I'd assume people like this song. So you're going to say? I'd assume, yeah, I'd assume they'd like it. And then, I, I mean, let's just go with it. Okay, you are correct. Like okay, good. That was uh, Barricade by Reaper. Oh, okay. uh, Reaper's been a new, newer, newer guy that's done a ton of like that heavy, hard DNB style, uh, and people really like what Reaper's put out. Okay, and so uh, that was guy. that was one of my top songs of last year, actually, or 2019, I believe. Um, yeah, I think it was. Yeah, it's a good track. I definitely would not mind find myself listening to that very often, but that's fair. In a certain mood, I'm sure I could get. Uh, so you are four. 
for, no, five for seven? Yeah, five for seven. Here yeah, we go. Track right. number eight. All right, here, let's go. All right, so that was like classic festival track, but does pe do people like that? in a good way or bad way? Is it classic? Well, I that it's I don't even know if you say good or bad because if you played six back to back, you wouldn't know which the difference was. <laughs> yeah, I they all you. sound the same. Yeah. So in my opinion, I don't like music that leads tends to sound the same. So I'm gonna say, yeah, let's just uh, let's pretend. No, not pretend. Oh man, do people don't really like this music, man? They probably do. I'm just going to say they don't. You're correct. Okay, they good. don't. That was yeah, a hated song. Goodness. That was a remix uh, by Audio Rockers, who have only ever done that one remix. Oh, it was a remix? Uh, it was originally by Nervo and Timmy Trumpet, or featuring Timmy Trumpet. Uh, okay. So it's just like a... It was a kind of remix. Yeah. yeah that's pretty yeah, much that. It's like the only... You'd only ever listen to it at a festival. You, you, people don't usually I agree. I think it's Big Room House is what the genre Big is. Big Room there. House? Yeah, that makes yeah. sense. Uh, here, so six for eight. Uh, here's track number nine. Yeah, these slower songs are tough to tell because, you know, someone could just love it because it is chill. Yeah. And there's others that just hate it because it is chill. So <laughs> I'm trying to... It isn't... Not... It, it doesn't stand out. Like, it's not like some... Whoa, the track's crazy. But it also doesn't scream like, this song sucks. <laughs> so it's... These are the tough ones. I'd say... Hmm. Yeah, I'd say people don't like that one. You are correct. Okay. That Sweet. was a hated song. Uh, that is Sabai. Uh, he's come in fairly recently and produced some fairly below average future bass, let's say. Some classic, like, Just yeah. like some kind of pop-oriented future bass. I had one really good song, I Need You, that people liked, but other than okay. that, it was, they are all like, this is kind of bad. Yeah, it's just like, there's no artist. Like, it doesn't scream something, you know? Yep, that's fair. So I totally think good. that's a big issue in a lot of... Medium music is people don't have enough okay. distinction. Uh, seven for nine, then. Okay. Uh, if you get the next three right, you can get ten. Um, but uh, here we go. Here is song number ten. Oh, I think I've heard this song before. Actually. Yeah. Yeah, So you have heard that song? Oh, yeah. Is it good, though, because you've heard it? I mean, I liked it because I've heard it before, and I'm pretty sure it's in my liked songs on Spotify. So <laughs> I'm going to guess people like that song. <laughs> okay, you are correct. Okay, uh, that is oh so Ellis. I, so, yeah, I figured that was Ellis. I was like, yeah. that sounds like Ellis. Like, so, like that was sorry. So that was Ellis. Yeah. 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 Uh, yeah I got There's much more to that. That was a fire, fire song, guys. Yeah. People really like that one a lot. Uh, so you're now eight for ten. Here we go. Two All left. Right. You got this. Uh, if, you, if you get both of them wrong, by the way, you're currently... Uh, tied for first place in terms of uh, Andrew and Skyler both got 8 for 12. So if you get them both wrong, you tie them, but I expect you to beat everyone. Yeah, because... I'll try my best. I'm doing my best here. <laughs> You've listened to lots of Monster Cat. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> and you listen to EDM. So here we go. Yeah. Song number 11. <laughs> What are the lights? I need the, I need the lights. <laughs> Alright. Alright. So what do you think of that? Alright. All right. 
right, all right. In all honesty, like that, it joins the club of songs I would only ever listen to if I was in a club. Okay. But I'm gonna have to say people don't like that one. You are incorrect. Man, people like that. <laughs> that is um, without listening to the, the more of just dude. the same by Infected Mushroom. Oh, okay, that so makes they sense. They do side trance. Uh, they just pretty much do side trance. Infected songs. Mushroom. Infected yeah, mushroom. I've never liked his stuff. Yeah, it's, it's just never been my cup of tea. That's fair. Me either. I'm not a huge Infected Mushroom fan, but uh, so that makes sense why you would also not like the other time. Yeah, I, I I could listen to it if I again if I was dancing and not really thinking about what I was listening to, but yeah, and that song also is like a longer song, so there's more movements to it. Oh, okay. But, not Still. just the drop or whatever. Uh, so here we go. If you get, if you don't get this last one, you don't take the lead for for <laughs> best. <laughs> I'll try for my best. Highest score, but uh, here you go. Song number twelve. All right. It's a hard last one. Yeah, both of these other two are hard. Well, this is tough. Oh, man, like, I was really trying to, like, absorb the layers to see if there's enough to be like, yeah, people, to give me a confident answer. Yeah, because, man, I keep forgetting that there's, like, weird niches of, of types of music that people mm -hmm. like. But on average, across the whole Monster community, is it loved or hated? I'd say because it sounds like it's an uncaged track. My guess would be that its tendency would be to be more liked than hated. So I'm going to guess it's liked. You're incorrect. Come on, bro. <laughs> so cringe. <laughs> so you tied uh, first. both Andrew and my sister. I That's that's wow. sort of sad to tie my sister and I guess even you know thing, but it happens. I mean, um, <laughs> I feel like I got kind of really hard tracks. I did. Really. I did specifically try to find ones that were going to be harder for you yeah, because... They, like, yeah, I, I definitely believe that a lot of those could flip either way. I don't know how close they were. That's, Maybe they're that's like fair. The thing is that. with other people who have come on, they listen to that last song, and they're like, this song, I hate this song, but do they love it? Who knows? They got like sort of coin flip. Yeah. Where for you, it's like it can go either way. And it's... Because, Yeah, I think because I've listened to enough music and I've seen people being like, oh, yeah, this is like my favorite song. And I'm like, wow, that's your favorite song. So it's like... <laughs> Part of it is, do the masses agree? But yeah, maybe I didn't take that into it yeah. too much. It's tough. I did try to trip you up a little bit. So I, I'll admit, I made job. these you the hardest ones. You did a good I job. possibly could. But uh, yeah, thank you for watching. Uh, I've been Dakota. This is Brady. Do you want to be a part of the voting on the boat community? The link will be in the description below to figure out uh, what songs are the best and worst or loved and hated. But uh, other than that, uh, I will see you guys in another video.